Welcome to today's class. Today we'll be looking at the attribute. We describe the attribute as a container of both spatial and non-spatial data in the previous video. So we're going to be looking at what the attribute is in terms of uh, its practical application in ArcGIS. Right? So uh, we're going to import something. So we just click on import. I would have imported it, but I just wanted us to be doing that so that we conversing with bringing in something into the ArcGIS environment. Okay, so um, this is a geodatabase of Taraba State. So I'm going to bring in local government boundaries. Yeah, so these are the local government boundaries of Taraba State. Now, attributes is a container of both spatial and non-spatial so it describes and you also locate. So uh, once you right click on the verify and you can have plenty of them lined up here. Once you right click on any of them, you'll come to open attribute. So you click on it. So it opens up. You can maximize to have a full screen so that you're able to do everything. Now, here we have object number one to 18, two, three to 18, okay? So, and the shape is telling you the shape that the shape is polygon, it's describing the shapes. Then the name, uh, name of the local government, EB local government, Karim local government, carry down to Lao local government. And right, then we have the headquarters, it's still describing. Then the geopolitical zone, which of the geopolitical zone this uh, place fall under? From here to here fall under Taraba South, not sorry. And uh, here fall under Taraba South, this Taraba North. Taraba South, Taraba Central, and then Taraba North. And then it has a ship length, and then it also has population. All right, so these are its population and all that. So basically, uh, you can add new field. You can, you know, right, click on here, and then you come to add new field and all that. So the attribute you can use attribute to do quite a number of things, right? So we have select by attribute and all that. So you can do a lot of things with the attribute. So in next video, we're going to be looking at how to edit an attribute. All right. So we're going to look at how to edit. For example, if I have done this, how do I write this name? How do I edit the name and all that? So that's what we'll be looking at in the next video. I'm taking them slow, slow so that you can be able to pick up and understand basically. So this is what the attribute is all about. And we will call this end of today's video.